Greetings and let us look at love messages for you, Cancer, today. Your first card is Three of Swords. Um, 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 um. Somebody must be sad, broken hearted. Rainy season, alone, lonely, disappointed. This is an ex. Some or someone is feeling like it is hard not having you. So hard not having you. They sing in the blues. They don't know what to do. Ooh, can't say it's hard not having you. They don't know what to do. This is true love. This person is feeling like this is true love. I really love you. So someone is missing you, wanting to connect it with you and looking for you. Something about father, father of the bride, dreaming about you, can't stop thinking about you. Something about their third eye or how they feel about you. You know what I mean. Two of cups and the six of diamonds. Yeah, someone is really in love with you. They're watching you, giving attention, wanting to flirt with you, dazzle you, impress you. Okay, the two of cups says soul ties. So this person, they're thinking they want to mate with you. Soul contract. They want to be with you. They want to give to you, commit to you. Be your mate, right? Your partner. They want to, they say this feels right. So someone is loving the feelings that you give to them. This person is thinking that you're going to heal them and make them better, right? They think that you've captured them. You've taken their power already. They've surrendered to you. Yeah, they're captivated, this card says. Captivated and starstruck. They're so into you. Falling in love. They listen to music and dance thinking that the music is talking about you and them. So they're just, uh, they, I hear vivid. They're daydreaming about you. Natural vibe. Familiar feeling. Naturally love you. Deeply love you. Okay. There's some third party energies. Two, two, two. Twin flames for surely. This person, they can't stop thinking about you, watching you. Alright, so let's get into it, beautiful souls. Take a deep breath here with me. Okay. Let's unveil your second card in this love reading. Yes, the six of diamonds. This person, they want to... Come in, flirt with you, giving you attention, spend time with you, spend money on you, give you the good feelings. They want to give you all the good things that they can give to you. They want to show up for you. They've been watching you, studying you. They have eyes for you. Um, they just want you to know how big, bold, beautiful Queen of Wands energy you are, how mesmerizing that it's really only you that full up their vibration, that take all of their time, their energy, their feeling, everything is just, is just you, they feel, that's how this person is feeling like, alright, okay, so yeah, Six of Diamonds, energy, like I say, for some, this is a family member, a father, or a mother figure that there seems to be no connection with that tree of swords and they want to connect. There could also be feelings of jealousy and competition. I hear indoctrination. You could also be feeling tired or sleepy or you're looking like you're looking divine. Yeah, wow, the strength card yeah i feel like you've grown up so much or grown so strongly confidently brave courageously that um so someone else is seeing that within you all right i hear partner someone from your past trust your intuition too you're getting some type of a glow up all right you're getting admiration a lot of i hear your skills a lot of people wanting to get to know who you are a lot of people have eyes on you spying on you watching you interested in you as a strength energy so you can feel that a lot of people wanting you to be in their life to tame them to settle down with them to make them feel peace a lot of them wanting to be under your bold beautiful captivating energy you're like a goddess you're out of this world so a lot of people wanting to come around and spy on you it reminds me of like Bathsheba and King David or the one that you can't really take your eyes off of yeah um so be mindful of many people wanting to be with you to to many suitors all right wanting to say how they feel wanting to say that they wish they could be with you they long to be with you and um how they're mesmerized by you how they're daydreaming of you blah 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 all of these things okay 
you you are worth it too you're like a kiss of god angel something like that vibration um something beautiful so i know you are protected and most i see is how glorious beautiful magnificent bold courageous and strong you are how attractive how magnetizing so you also have this protecting eye watching over you for real it's like most eyes watching you as you you are by yourself getting a lot of attention from like you're like on top of a hill and there you're surrounded by people wanting to come into your vibration so it's like it's your time you're on your throne you're in the prime time of your life okay so you could be and some delay as well you may be waiting for the right person the right one to show up yeah i'm just feeling a sense of pride for you from this most high or higher energy because you've chosen to really love yourself heal level up choose you that's why you're getting so much attention and there's someone that is looking at you and for regretting something that they did because they know that they like whatever they did to maybe mess up a connection with you because they know that they can't come back into your life so you're being highly admired and appreciated for looking like you're in love with yourself like you look like you love yourself you're falling in love with yourself the way how you dress the way how you move the way how you live how you talk how you eat how you walk how you see how you feel you just look like you're falling in love with yourself you may be a dressmaker you just take time with yourself you love yourself and people can see that in how you move how you live you have a natural vibe to you and it's just naturally attracting people to your energy because you seem to be so into yourself. Deeply in love with you is how people feel. People just walk and they may buck their toe, stumble on something because they keep looking at you, right? They're not even realizing that they're just staring at you, not looking where they're going. And then they may just poop put the toe and then have to come back in reality. That's what you do. That's the energy that you have right now. So a lot of people wanting to know what you are into. Familiar feeling. You pull things out of people. You remind people of their past. You talk about their father. You talk about their history. Even if it, just by looking at you, you just are surreal. Just by looking at you, people remember some connection to their family, to some familiar feelings. They wonder how you know that story. Just by looking at you, they just feel like you know something of them. It's weird. Like, just by looking at you, someone feel like they remember their mother or their grandmother. And they're wondering how you know about their grandmother. It's not that you know anything. They know you know, you know. It's just that they know that the impression came off of them looking at you. How can you give me these feelings? How can you remind me of certain things that you wouldn't even know about? Good, you know? Um, naturally love you so it is easy to like you easy to love you easy to appreciate you all right um yeah let's see what your next card is today the world card seeing success in some shape or form i'm seeing motherhood and there could be pregnancy as well here or there's someone that's gonna Put out some extra effort to be around you, be in your life. Because I hear labor. Right? So there's someone that's going to be putting out, like going the extra mile to step forward. I hear adjacent. So you may have multiple people interested in you too. Yeah, so they're still watching you and they want to come in with an offer. So it could be two of them that's interested in, like, stepping forward. Right? Tower card is next. Tower card. The tower card, you seem to be insightful at this time. Focused, determined, aligned, attuned. Like you're not going to miss a beat. You're staying on is the energy. Whatever that means. Alert, aware of where you're going. No distractions, no fake people, no falls. Whatever, you're, you're just more... Steady on where you're going. Mm -hmm. Distractions. You don't want to be a part of this distracting energy. You don't want... Like, as soon as you feel like something is... You're just, like, low tolerance for unserving energies right now. Right? So, you're just... You're going to make sure you do the right thing. Like, dot your T's, cross your eyes, because you don't have time for error. 
because I think you have this great vision going forward or this is what Mosai has for you. You're here to heal or to fix or to be like, to make a new way or something. Yeah, the Ace of Cups is like a lot of love. So even though it's like you have this great mission, Cancer, all right, you have a great and wonderful mission. You are actually psychic. Yeah. You are psychic. You're telepathic. Yep. You have so many gifts and powers. Your dreams, your visions. Um, your ability to bring new new energies into the world. You should not be blocked or stopped. You feel like you have something else dealing with the, that five of wands. Maybe some drama. Something about being antisocial. Are not wanting to give your attention to um to certain things because you have big vision. All right, there's someone that wants to give all of their attention to you, but they think you're ignoring them. Someone may be thinking you think you're better than them when you could be just be shy and just caught up in your own headspace, you know. So just be mindful of people that try to give you attention but then you're feeling like they may end up feeling like you you blow them off you don't want to talk to them then they may change their attitude toward you to start to say you act like you're nicer or whatever when that's literally not the case all right so some people may be looking for you to smile more and um someone feeling miserable in some way shape or form but um, you're going to get over that. Someone is really missing you. All right. Someone is missing you, thinking about you and watching you a lot. Wherever they are, it's like they're thinking about like you're thinking about you as if you're right there. To how hard someone is thinking about you. Six of Cups energy and the King of Cups. You're also about to find a new love. Like you won't be able to stop this new person that's moving into your life. They're coming in quickly and they're they're gonna be determined to be with you because they feel very sure four of cups they feel very sure but you may not feel sure about this because you still want to heal and be your best self you still feel to me like you don't want to be taken for granted you're trying to fix this and fix that right but someone else is feeling stuck without you and they're very like feeling conflicted. They in the past someone didn't choose you. Yeah, they cheated. They didn't choose you. They were conflicted. Should they choose you or not? But a choice was made. Separation happened tower. And now um someone is like longing for you. Longing to be back in your life, but you're not open to this connection and they feel vexed. I know they want to come around with some different type of offer. Like, okay, maybe if I offer you something more, you should say yes then. That's what that's the attitude that they have. And then when you don't accept that so-called more offer from them, they, they feel like you, you are being stuck up or stubborn or something. Right? Like you owe them your heart space. You're entitled. They are entitled to it or something. Um, so I'm getting just keep loving you. Um, leveling up something is not your problem this tower moment that is happening for someone because like I'm getting also if someone chose someone other than you they chose wrong right they, that person was not their twin flame or something that they, now they're miserable and kind of want to take it out on you but that's not like no you are living legend upon this mountain side that most high has daintily diligently placed you not just by chance but because you also worked hard on yourself cancer so you're very well protected and preserved and the best thing for you will come true that's what we're looking out for take it easy out there all is well all is within you be proud of yourself be humble in yourself too meditate more please hydrate love yourself be appreciative your money is come is gonna um whatever you're looking for stability in, it's gonna come through. You're gonna separate from a, a chaotic, dramatic, miserable vibration, and be more in to in your heart space. And there, you're gonna see some beautiful things start to manifest for you. Like there are people that are facing their karma 
is what I'm feeling like as a lot of truth is coming out. The moon card, the knight of swords. And so each people having to deal with their own mirror, their own reflection, their own pain. A lot of people can't take out their stress on you anymore. Like you're not available. You're not, you're out of their league, out of their reach. All right. So I'll see you out there in the next one. Beautiful soul. Have a great day. All is well and all is within you. If you need anything more, let me know. Take care. Bye. Love you.